That's what I like. Oh yeah, they, they nah, you up. got to earn this one now. You got to get up here now. I'm down here with you. Yeah, yeah. Reach your ass off, garbage ass nigga. I will cook your shit, boy. I'll cook your old ass nigga. I don't even know what the fuck kind of jays them in, but I'm some, but I'm look like some jays we had in third grade, my nigga. Old ass. Why? I'm look like some jays I had in third grade, my nigga. I'm glitching. Oh, I gave up. Give oh, green light then. Fuck you, nigga. Shit. <laughs> Shit, don't flop on me, boy. Don't flop on me, boy. Boy, I will cook you. I will cook you. Yeah. 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 Old ass nigga. Boy, you got some Teen Jordans on, boy. Kill yourself. Kill yourself, boy. You got on Teen Jordans, yeah, nigga. <laughs> Them ain't even retros, but I'm Team Jordans, boy. I remember them bitches from third grade, boy. Know some young niggas like to game. Know some young niggas like to game. She give me head, I call her mother brain. Girl, I'm going in in 60 frames. I don't even know why you came. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Lucy Shotta coming at y'all with another video today, man. Hey, I know y'all ain't heard my voice in a minute, man, but hey, I have not forgotten about y'all, man. Bro, I think about 2K all the time, believe it or not. As busy as I am, I still be brainstorming on, on what can make this game lit again, bro. I be thinking about it all the time. I'm always on some 2K19 shit, man. I got mad wish list videos on the way, bro. But I ain't gonna try to make this video too long, bro. We're gonna try to get right into this shit, dog. I've been thinking about something near and dear to my heart, bro. Why did they take away part badges? Furthermore, why did they take away the grand badge? That's the biggest thing. I miss the grand badge, bro. Like, they took Goku mode away from me, coach. Like, bro, I was so disappointed when I seen that little bitch ass fire emoji next to my name when this game first came out, bro. It does nothing, bro. Like, even when you on a hot streak, you're not really on a hot streak, bro, because you about to break your next damn shot as if you not boosted right now. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's pointless, bro. They just, I don't know if you noticed, but I ain't used Goku mode in none of these videos this year, bro. But, why would I, bro? Please tell me what game mode or what gameplay that I went Ultra Instinct Goku on. None, bro. I have no gameplays like 2K17. I used to go bananas on that game, but there's no point in using that shit on this game, bro. Everything is random. But I was thinking about that in a correlation with part boost. Remember. That unfair advantage that Sunset niggas had, bro. Sunset niggas got to do shit that they wasn't supposed to be able to do just because they were Sunset niggas. Remember in 2K16 where if a nigga had a 6 foot 7 point guard, he could only speed boost with him if he was a Sunset nigga. Carry that shit over to 2K17 with the 6 foot 2 sharpshooters. Niggas had speed boost and sharpshooters, but only if you was a Sunset nigga though. If you was a rivet nigga and you had a six foot two sharpshooter, he wasn't speed boosting. He was moving regular. I don't get that. That was dumb as hell to me. Like that that was unfair to me just because it just didn't make sense with the documented part boost that these niggas had. Because sunset niggas, if you look it up, sunset has a boost on shooting and rebounding. So if these niggas was shooting real good, like if sharpshooters was just absolutely unconscious then it would have made sense but speed boosting is in relation to ball handling which is the boost that old town niggas had old town niggas had the good handles and shit so i feel like they should have been the ones who had the the speed boosting for niggas who wasn't supposed to speed boost or whatever you know what i'm saying but 
that made me think about it, bro. Like, bro, they could bring that back next year, bro, and it could be so lit, bro. Tell me that shit wouldn't be lit if they brought back the part boost, but actually, like, have them be a significant boost that you can use and abuse and shit. But I'm gonna break that shit down in a couple different ways because I got a couple of different ways that they can implement this shit, bro. What if your park affiliation gave you certain boosts for certain badges that you had? Like, let's talk about Sunset. Sunset niggas is known for rebounding and shooting. So what if all of they sharpshooters had they sharpshooting badges bumped up one tier? What if all they rebounders had they hustle rebounder bumped up one tier? It could be silver. If they were Sunset, that bitch automatically goes to gold. Let's take Rivet City. We supposed to be known for our athleticism. We supposed to be tough guys and shit. So what if our fucking slashers had mad posterizer, like God tier posterizer, my nigga? What if our sharpshooters could get posterizers in certain situations? Like, of course, we don't want to abuse the shit because that would be unfair if sharpshooters could just posterize niggas like they slashes but what if every now and then your sharpshooter could get a posterizer just because he a rivet city nigga you know what i'm saying because let's not forget sunset got the speed boost when they were not able to speed boost so i feel like we should be able to do shit that we ain't supposed to be doing old town they got the ball handling and shit so what if they ankle breaker went up a tier just for being an old town nigga what if they dimer went up a tier what if we even got certain part badges for being in the park? I feel like Rivet City, our park badge should be park bully. Since we the athletic niggas, since we the niggas that, that's from the hood, really, you know what I'm saying? We got the chain nets and shit. We all about hard-nosed basketball. We should automatically get park bully. You know what I'm saying? Old Town, them boys got the ball handles. They should be the only niggas who get bone collector. You know what I'm saying? Now, let, let's piggyback on the last idea that I gave about boosting certain badges. Let, let, let's, let's keep that in mind, but like let's scratch that at the same time. What if you got all of those things that I mentioned for being with a certain affiliation, but it only happened when you was on the hot street? Meaning that you got a part grand badge a part badge whatever you want to call that shit the part badge the sunset badge what if let's say i'm a river city nigga i'm a sharpshooter of course i'm always gonna be a sharpshooter that's that's me i'm a sharpshooter let's say i'm out here shooting the lights out and i finally get hot and i get my grand badge my grand part badge that is now i should be able to dunk on niggas just because they allowed me to get that hot i mean that's of course, punishing niggas for letting me even get that hot. I mean, like I said, let, let's let's not make it abusable. But, like, for real, I think if I'm a River City nigga and we supposed to be known for our athleticism and rim-rattling dunks, as y'all used to call that shit, if I'm a sharpshooter and I'm going off and I get on a hot street to where I get my grand badge, my grand part badge, I should be able to start dunking on niggas. I should get a little bit of boost in strength for a certain amount of time. And then when that grand badge shuts off, I'm back to being a weak ass sharpshooter. What if Sunset, if a nigga get on a hot streak and he get his grand part badge, now he a slasher that can shoot threes. He a slasher that can get his, his hustle, re, he got hustle rebound, he got put back king. His put back king is on God tier at this point since he's hot. He can do whatever the fuck he want to for a short amount of time. Old Town. Nigga got bone collected when he get on the hot street. He can start breaking ankles all over the damn place. He get mad dimer. Whatever pass he make, if he, if he... If a nigga shoot the ball, that bitch most likely gonna go in because this nigga hot. You know what I'm saying? Bring back the feel of the grand badge. Wouldn't that shit be dope, bro? Especially if they added some of that cartoonish shit back into the shit, bro. Where, like, 
if you a River City nigga, you got your grand badge, you start dunking, the rim actually starts to rattle and shit like that, like hard. Like the script, remember the screen shaking in 2K16, bro? Only when you got your grand badge type shit, bro. If you a sunset nigga, you know what I'm saying? You done, you done got your grand part badge and you started shooting the lights out. Where the fire in the ball? Put the put the fire trail back in the ball, bro. Same for these these old town niggas, bro. If they got their grand badge out, man. Put that fire back in the ball while they dribbling, bro. Nigga, nigga we miss shit like that. I mean, I don't know about y'all, but I miss that shit, bro. That shit used to fuck with me all the time. When I would be playing 2K16, and all of these niggas keep putting up these shots, and they got this fire in the ball, but there ain't no fire in the ball. When I shoot like that, I'm like, I didn't get it. I'm like, bro, why does they, why do they have fire in the ball, and I don't? How do I get that fire in the ball? Is my shot not good enough? Do I need boost? And then I figured out right before 2K17 came out when I switched to Sunset. Oh, that's just a Sunset thing. And then Old Town, they had the little fire in the ball when they dribbled, but but they ain't show River City no love. We ain't get the fire in the ball. Let me get that fire in the ball when I dunk on me and nigga, dog. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, bro. I just want to, I just want to bring the fun back in the game, bro. I want to bring back some of that old shit, but like still keep it somewhat competitive too, bro. Like we want a competitive game, but most of all, we just want a fun game. As much shit as I talk about 2K, I want 2K to succeed, bruh. I do. Because it's that one game that I could just chill out and play without having to concentrate extra hard. When I'm playing Call of Duty, I can't just chill and play Call of Duty. I got to be keyed in and concentrating and trying to be on my toes at every point in the damn game. I don't got to do that with 2K. I can just relax, bruh. So, I mean, I got to have that type of game to play when I just want to chill, bruh. But anyway, man, it's your boy Lust. He shot it, man. I'll come at y'all boys with some more heat soon, bruh. Subscribe to the channel if you new. Hit that like button if you rocking with this video. And leave a damn comment, bro. What y'all boys think? What y'all want to see in 2K19, huh? Huh?